and welcome back to a brand new video and inside this video i'm going to show you guys how to make a rainbow themed room since the new mega neon pet just came out and it is kind of like a rainbow neon pet so i was like why don't we make a rainbow themed room just like the pet so yeah and without further ado let's get right into the video so first i'm going to start on making a bed and for the bed i'm going to make a cloud bed so i'm going to make a floating cloud with a rainbow headboard on top so for the cloud i'm going to use some modern coffee table and some bean bags and i'm going to make two layers of clouds using them So I placed down all the coffee table using big grid and now I'm going to go into small grid and kind of mess them up a little bit so this way they look messier and looks like a real cloud. And afterwards, I'm going to get seven of these decorative arch and color them the color of the rainbow. So I am going to make the rainbow a pastel rainbow. And I did take out a few colors because they're just too similar like pastel orange and pastel yellow. So in my last video that I posted a few months ago that has something rainbow in it, so many of you guys have commented that I forgot the colors of the rainbow. And I just want to say that I did not and I took out some colors because it feels like it just takes too much space and sometimes they look too similar and they make the color blocks too big, so yeah. So I was going to add a unicorn horn and some ears to the rainbow but then I feel like it is kind of too big and it kind of blocks everything so I ended up taking them off.
So for this part, it is completely optional because the neon signs are quite expensive. But it feels like it looks really cute if you guys can afford it. So I am going to change the wallpaper for two of the walls and the reason is because I feel like the rainbow mermaid wallpaper is already really colorful and I added another rainbow headboard so I'm afraid it's gonna look really messy because there's too many colors going on so I'm going to change two of the walls that's next to the bed and I was like playing around with these rugs because I feel like I don't want to do a plain one color wallpaper I also don't want to do like a very regular rug wallpaper so I'm like, I'm trying to come up with something and I made this played looking wallpaper like half played and not gonna lie, I actually like it. So for this part, I was gonna make like a levitating circle that has some cloud chairs on top But like I pictured it very perfectly and very cute in my head But when I was doing it, it doesn't look as I imagined in my head because I feel like it will look better if it's like neon and glowing and stuff and it's not So I end up failing on this and just making it on the floor And even though I failed on the other one, I still really like how I made this design on the floor. I placed two circles together and made them different colors, and I think it looks very unique. So on top of it, I'm going to make a cloud light that I made in my baby room video. And I'm absolutely falling in love with this light, and I think this video is the perfect time to use it again. And on top of it, I'm going to make a cloud light that I made in my baby room video. And I am absolutely in love with this light and I feel like this video is a perfect time to make it again. And also next to you, I'm going to add a shelf using chopping boards and barrier. And over here in this corner, I'm going to add a window with some shields as curtains and also adding a desk under it.
now our dam is built, it is time for a tour. Thank you so much for watching and if you like the video please leave a like and also subscribe for more videos and I'll see you guys next time